So this is my first product review. I want to review a product tonight. I want to review the Halti Lead. Hey guys, right, so uh, I'm really excited. I, I'm, I'm sorry, I've got to explain. I'm, I'm in a bit of a hurry because my battery is like running really low and I need to get this done and I've got to get back. I've got to go and sort the kids out because I'm on kid duty tonight, uh, which I can't wait for. I'm really excited for. So I'm really, 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 really behind. So this is my first product review. I want to review a product tonight. I want to review the Halti Lead. I want to review the Halti Lead. I'm going to say it again. Um, and <laughs> look at this boy, look at this. <laughs> He's a big oaf. Uh, that is Oscar. That... God damn it. That is Oscar, by the way. No, it's not. It's Chester. What am I talking about, Oscar? It's Chester. His name is Chester. Um, and uh, he is a uh, dog to Bordeaux and he's helping me today with uh, with my review. So we're talking about the Halti lead and um, the benefits of it and why I love this lead. This is like the, this is the lead I love the most. Um, I think it's something that every dog owner should carry in their toolbox um, because it's just so versatile. It does so many things. It's good quality. It's reasonably priced. I mean, I think these things come in at like 14, 14 or 15 pounds, something like that, I don't know. Um, but they're reasonably priced and they have so many benefits to using these but the two latches here one is slightly smaller than the other as you can see they are very very close but one is slightly smaller than the other um, one is to go onto a head collar the gentle leader the thing that stops the dog from pulling and then the other could go either on the collar or on the harness now i love that because it if you don't use the the head collar though um, you can just put one on the harness and one on the collar if you want to and i'm going to show you the benefits of doing that Okay, so if I can get Chester to play ball. So here we go. So we've got the two latches here, okay. What I'm gonna do is put one, he's got a, a collar <laughs> and he's got a harness on. <laughs> I'm gonna put one on his collar and I'm gonna roll him over and put one on his harness. Okay, so he's got one on his collar. <laughs> he's got one on the collar. And one on his harness and this really is kind of like the ultimate way of controlling the dog because um, he's a big he's a big boy he's like 10 10 stone something like that so he's the weight of, of many um, dare I say it women uh, he's the weight of a, of, an, of a female adult female you really want to control his weight as best as possible and this is the best way in my opinion to do that with this lead it gives you that ability to use his, his collar if you need to, to just control him, like a horse, a little bit. Um, and then the harness just allows him, when he's moving forward, I can put slack on the collar part of the lead. My hand is a little bit closer to the, the harness. I cannot stop him as good as I can stop him just on the collar and just bring him around and get some control from him because he's such a big boy. Even with training, I mean, there's a chance that, of course, you're going to need that physical restraint with him um, at some point. And, and this is why I love using it on a dog, because it just gives you that, that ability to do it. The other reason why we may want to use this lead is really cool. So if I sh Okay, let me get his lead for you. His lead, if I can get out of his mouth, is a normal lead, a little bit longer than the normal actually, but only has one latch. Now if I can just get it on him. <laughs> now. now I've latched his lead on him. And I'm gonna show you something that I can do with the other lead. Okay, so what I've done now is I've put his lead on him <coughs> and I've latched the, he has a little uh, uh, O-ring here. 
which I've now put the halty on. And what I've done with the halty, I don't know if you can see it because I've got a black t-shirt, but I've now put the halty into a loop. I've used one of their D-rings, put it into a loop, put it round my chest. And now if I can get it moving, come mate, I can go hands-free, continue my vlog, <laughs> continue my vlog and have him walk with me um, and know that he's not disconnected in any way from my side. So there is the beauty of that lead in that instance. Let's get that there. So the other thing is, of course, if I let my dog off the lead, I now have a, uh, an easy way of attaching this lead so I'm not carrying it. I'm no longer carrying this lead around. I don't need to. I'm not carrying it. I can now whip it over my shoulder. It's nice and easy. I've got a nice space here. It's not hanging too low. It's just by heat by my uh, by my hip, and it means I've got I've got a nice lead across my chest, out of the way, and I can walk and enjoy what I'm doing without. I don't know if you can see the black on black, but it's just sitting there. It's nice, nicely neatly tucked away, just there. And it means I've got freedom now to, to move around. Oh, there we have it. I've got a halty lead, which I absolutely love and I think should be in everybody's toolbox. These are also amazing for dog trainers, dog behaviorists. Anybody who's working with a dog needs one of these leads. I really cannot tell you how much, how good they are, in fact. Now, I've gone with this brand because I like the, I like the, the um, quality of the lead. It's a, it's a durable, strong lead. Um, all the stitching is really good on it. The, the clasps and everything are really good. The O-rings, the D-rings, they're all solid. Um, and they will hold a good weight of dog, such as Chester. Um, now you can get a slightly thinner one, so half the size of this one, um, which is, again, ideal for the smaller dog. So like a Dachshund, a, a small Cocker Spaniel, something like that. Again, you know, you can also use them. We use them on our daycare where uh, if we want to attach a dog to ourselves to ensure that dog doesn't um, run off anywhere or do anything, then we've got them pretty much attached. For this video, um, I'm really excited because this is um, a review video and it's one of my first, it is my first review video, and I really want to make some more of these. I want to review more products. Um, so if you'd like to give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, links below. Uh, please subscribe, because if you don't subscribe, I can't make these videos. I can, but I'm not going to, because there's no point if nobody's there watching them. So, really hope you enjoy it. Um, and it's a lovely evening now. It's, uh, what's the date? 20th, Saturday the 20th of October in Wales, little UK. Um, if you don't know where Wales is, have a look on the map, it's Wales. Uh, and it's just such a beautiful evening right now. I mean... Sun is just setting over the hills behind us on the training grounds. Sheep just in this field here, just on the hills, and they're just quieting down. I just love it. I just love. I just love where we are with our training facility, it's just brilliant. I'm gonna tilt that down a bit, a bit high. Um, so anyway, subscribe to the channel guys and, and I really hope that uh, I can be making some more of these. Uh, let me know in the comments below what you'd like me to review as well. If there's anything you've seen on the market that you think, you know what, I'd love to know what that is like and we'll look to uh, review that product. Just to be absolutely clear, I am not associated with this company whatsoever, nor is our, my company. Uh, we are not affiliated, I have nothing to do with them, they haven't sponsored this. I am purely and simply telling you what my favourite lead is, and this is my favourite lead. It's the one that needs to be in everybody's toolbox if you have a dog. Whether you have a behaviour dog, uh, a dog that has no behavioural problems, or just generally you are a dog owner that just wants a lead. These are great, and if you have multiple dogs, they're good for that too, because you can put two on the same lead. You can put two, one on this side, one on that side. Although I wouldn't do that necessarily, but you can do that. As long as they're good dogs, you can do that. But anyway, there we go. Okay, see you later, guys.